Hello friends, uh, this is Lakshman. You are watching Learn Programming by Lakshman YouTube channel. So in this video, uh, I am talking about uh, the famous entry question that is the uh, um, difference between manual testing and uh, automation testing. And also we will uh, cover uh, where we should use manual testing and uh, automation testing and which scenario we are going to use uh, uh, manual and uh, automation testing okay so testing is an integral part of any successful software project manual testing and automation testing both are important for developing application manual testing and automation testing uh, both contains the same purpose only it also depends on the cost and benefit of your particular project well basically software testing is broadly categorized manually and automation testing then what is manual testing manual testing means it is a type of testing in which test cases are executed manually that means by humans without any support of tool or script it, it may take uh, it takes initially uh, much time as testing as testing is performed manually but the period of time we need more time and human resources so it is a time consuming process and investment is required for human resources investment is required for human resources And manual testing is only practical if test cases are run once or twice. That means uh, only you need to test for one or two times only, then it is preferable for manual testing. If it is repeatedly, uh, you need to test uh, again and again, then it is not recommended to use manual testing. Okay. And manual testing involves human observation which may be more useful if goal is user friendly and customer experience okay so uh, whereas automation testing automation testing it execute the test scripts by using tools and scripts okay so initially it takes time to create the scripts and uh, the whole setup uh, but the latter uh, it takes uh, uh, less time than manual to perform regression testing okay so it is more reliable uh, it is more uh, reliable uh, as it is performed by tools and uh, scripts and the investment is is required for tools and training. Okay, so automated testing is a practical when test cases are run repeatedly over a long period of time. Okay, so whenever when we are using automated testing, testing means when test cases are run repeatedly over and over for a long period of time then it is recommended to use automation testing and automation testing does not guarantee user friendliness or positive customer experience okay uh, the next thing is suppose if you take a project in a project where the content is large and the testing phase are run for a quite a long time then automation testing is the perfect choice because it reduces the number of resources required okay. and uh, multiple types of similar test cases scenarios can be executed simultaneously with a single script it can execute multiple scripts 
multiple scripts same time okay and for a large project the estimated budget is sufficient enough to afford the setup and maintenance of an automated testing tool however in small projects uh, where the testing phase runs for only few weeks then manual testing is more preferable so it is a small project and uh, the testing cases uh, you need to run the uh, only for few weeks then manual testing is preferable since uh, um, it, uh, resources do not have enough time to get trained in the tools and start testing so maintenance and installation time consuming and costly so there is a less need of uh, simultaneous execution of multiple test cases of a similar nature okay then comes to the accuracy of uh, uh, results we will compare both in accuracy of results so for a testing phase where duration is long there are high chance of an undetected error when testing is performed manually okay that means uh, if there is a, a long project the duration is very long so there are high chance of undetected error when testing is performed manually every time a small defect is fixed the entire application need to be tested to ensure that any other uh, breakage is not occurring the process is very tiring uh, and the testers often tend to miss out small uh, but a critical defects uh, while performing repeated testing whereas uh, automation testing uh, involves execution of scripts that perform repeated testing of the application over and over again since the machine does not get tedious if the script is properly written there are no chance of missing a defect when the test is executed over and over again uh, then comes to the uh, regression testing So regression testing is a phase that involves constant code changes and a testing how the application is responding to frequent changes. If you perform manually, if you uh, regression testing is performed manually, there are a high chance of error since uh, human eye often misses small changes while observing the same thing repeatedly. In case of large application, it takes a number of testers to perform these repeated tasks. Whereas uh, automation testing, when automation testing is used, regression testing to speed up the process by repeated execution of test cases. And multiple test case scenarios can be simultaneously executed. So it saves the time by parallel execution along with the other test cases. Then what about the nature of the application? Nature of the application. Apart from the uh, complexity of the application and project duration, the nature of the application also decides the, what kind of testing is better to test it. Suppose uh, for a banking application, a number of scenarios requires testing like uh, uh, validation during user login, security protocols during banking op operation, security testing for fraudulent activities during the transactions. For these kind of scenarios, testing is completed much faster when, when a well written script is executed. Since most of the testing involves repetitive operations of the same scenario but with different entities, hence automation testing is better. For a small web application like a personal blog page or the page of a small business like a restaurant and the look and feel of the application along with the user experience is important in this scenario testing is needed to be done based on the human experience so testers should think from the prospect of an end user and test the application to find out bugs or defects that may hamper user experience since no automated testing tools are not yet discovered that can replace human experience so manual testing is more preferable for this scenario okay so these are the uh, main differences between manual and uh, automation testing and, uh, and which scenarios we are using manual and uh, 
automation testing. So let me tell you uh, which scenario we are going to use uh, manual and uh, automation testing. For manual testing, Uh, manual testing is best suited uh, these these scenarios that is exploratory exploratory testing so this type of testing requires uh, the tester's knowledge experience logical skills creativity the test is uh, characterized here by poorly written specification doc document. We need the human skills to execute the testing process in this scenario. Uh, the next one is usability testing. So this is uh, an area in which you need to measure how user friendly and efficient uh, or convenient the software or product uh, for the end user so here human observation is the most important factor so a manual approach is preferable the last one is uh, ad hoc testing ad hoc testing so in this scenario uh, there is no specific approach it is a totally unplanned method of testing where the understanding and uh, insight of the tester is the uh, only important factor okay whereas automation testing in which scenario we are going to use automation testing so regression testing so here automated testing is uh, suitable because of uh, frequent port changes and uh, the ability to run the regression in a timely manner okay the next one is load testing so automated testing is also the best way to complete the testing efficiently when it comes to the load testing. Okay. So the next one is uh, repeated testing. Repeated execution. Okay. Testing which requires the repeated execution of a task is the best automated. The next one is uh, performance testing. performance testing so similarly testing which requires the simultaneous of thousands of concurrent users requires automation so keeping these factors in mind you can find the best approach in any given testing situation and achieve quality output well within our budget and timeline so that's all about uh, my side so i hope you have got it so thanks for watching.